here are some normal art supplies. But today I'm going to be painting with things only found in nature. And here's my cat coming to say hi. So, and here it comes trying to grab one. But I'm going to go outside and try and make all the things found in nature. So, I hope you guys come with me. I might use paper. I might not depend on what I find. So, let's go on this trip together. So, guys, right now I'm in my backyard. I found some of this stuff. And we're going to go out front. And I got a little basket. I got these pink things. These yellow flowers. Well, 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 they happen to be very helpful. By the way, when you guys just seen me running, it was because I forgot my basket. What is that? Please tell me. And look at this web. Does anyone know what it is? If you guys do, please comment below because I'm super curious and I've seen a bunch of them. Um, there was a battle. <laughs> Not going to be using that. So, so guys, I put the like flowers and leaves and all that stuff in this little ball. So, I'm going to open it up and I'm going to wash them with cold water, carefully, not to damage any of the color, so that way they'll clean it off. I'm going to make sure it's some nice cold water. Okay, I think it's bloody. So you can see all the dough come off, so what I'm going to do is like fill it, and then put it in. And when I'm done doing that, I'll get back. Side note, side note, oh my gosh, guys, can I speak? I put the peanut shell in here because I didn't want to, like, wear it out too bad, but the rest of it, it actually kind of looks pretty like that. We'll get back to you guys when that's... Okay, guys, I let that dry, and although I said I don't know if I'm going to do for paper because obviously I'm not buying paper out there, but I did find some cool board I can recycle. And like paint brushes and containers for making it, I am gonna use my own. So let's get into it. So first, I'm gonna have the water heat up. I'm gonna only do like a thin piece, and I'm gonna rinse this out well. It's heating up, guys. It's only black paint, so don't worry about that. That's all that is. It's nothing. Or Okay, good enough. It doesn't need to be perfect. After all, I am using a little recycled stuff. Well, natural stuff, whatever. I hope y'all can hear me. Okay, now it's getting hot. I'm gonna put this in here. I'm gonna go to this section and I'm gonna grab a some of these wild berry things. Hope they're not poisonous. <laughs> now it's a little too late for that. And I'm gonna let those soak in a couple minutes or for a little bit and then I'll be back. And while that's going on, now that I don't have anything that could lose color, I'm just gonna let that soak in hot water. Get this little guy. Oh, it's going down. I don't know if anyone killed or not, but just so you guys know, not, none of it went down the drain. <laughs> guys, my original plan was I was going to use like dandelions, but I couldn't find any. I don't know what I'm going to do with this crushed peanut. Well, this peanut, I haven't crushed it yet. Because, but I thought maybe some kind of brown paint. Or something like that. So I'm gonna make a quick workspace. So I'm just gonna wipe that off. So I don't know if any of you are okay, but here's my workspace. I have the peanut heel, and so I figure out what I'm going to do with it. The sink with the flowers in it. I have this, like the strawberries with the water. This is going to be making a little pain. Oh, and I don't know if I will finish with saying the whole dandelion thing. So if some of you still don't know, if you take like a dandelion, 
we smudge the sin a little bit. It leaves like a yellow powell, but I couldn't find any, so yeah, here it is. Oh, and this, I put a clean one in case you need it, because anytime you're doing projects, you're gonna need it. So time to finally try and do some of these. You might have this casual set up on the white piece around. But, okay. I don't really show how to smash it. Do you guys think that'll help? Well, I'm gonna add on somebody's who the light goes on. I guess I'm gonna like do the same thing. You guys see that? Guys, this is why I'm doing it on the sink. I'm not sure if you guys it's how. There's like a bunch of world just kind of showing. It's fine. Guys, I'm gonna just do it on the white cow so you guys can see like nothing. But, on the plus side, I could use that stuff as like sprinkles maybe, like the seed things. So, let's try out the next batch of trying to do paints. Guys, so I'm filming this video a couple hours later from where you guys see me originally get this stuff. And now it happens to be dull color, so I can't really go out and like pick things and see what they all. So I have to try and make sure I get the recipe down before I just use a bunch of them. So I guess that's this. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is use a little bit of yellow, a global of green with a little stem, a paint on, a small thing of pink. And one of these, since I haven't had a lot of those. And yeah. This time, I'm gonna actually try a new method. So, sorry guys about the odd camera angle. I just need to make it bigger so you guys can see more. So, I'm actually gonna swap these around because of my new method idea. I'm going to transfer this in the veil. Once I have the tail. And put these in the veil. This is very hot bottle, so I'm hoping for the best. Okay, now that that's done, I'm going to put this in the veil. But, since it's not like there's any liquid, a little bit of milk too. And it's kind of like a... I don't know actually how to describe what I'm trying to say. Oh, that's actually really hot. So if this doesn't work, I don't exactly know what I'm going to do. Well, enjoy a time lapse of this sadness, if anything. So I'm going to let this soak and hope for the best. So here I go. Okay, guys, that hot it really quick for me, but that's actually really long for me. But I'm thinking... I almost scrapped this video, but instead I had a better idea. So guys, don't mind. Don't think I'm not doing it. So instead, I'm actually going to do a decoupage. So I'm going to use the yellow for this. A little pink there. I should actually get two pieces first to do this. Hold on. Okay, so I got the tweezers, and there's my new method. I'm gonna dip a piece of here, stick it on Actually, I'm gonna move this over here, so I need the brush. So 
so once I got that, I'm just going to do a bunch of these and time lapse it. So enjoy. final product what do you guys think do you guys like it i think it's going to well for what i had and for almost giving up halfway through so hope you guys like it if you guys do make sure you guys like this video hope to see you guys in the next video bye